using index and match functions, we can do a lookup based on two or more criteria. You can use this generic array formula, return range, range from which to return a value, criteria one, criteria two, etc. are the conditions to be met. Range one, range two are the ranges on which the corresponding criteria should be tested. You can expand it to as many criteria as you want. For example, use this formula to look up the price based on item, size and color. We have three criteria entered in G3, G4 and G5. D2 to D10 is the range to return a value from. G3 is criteria 1. A2 colon A10 is the range to compare against criteria 1 and so on. The formulas use the index match functions that looks through a single column. To evaluate multiple criteria, create two or more arrays of true and false values that represent matches and non-matches for each individual criterion. For example, this expression returns an array of true or false comparing each value in the item range A2 to A10 with the item value in G3. The next expression compares each value in the size range B2 to B10 with the size value in G4. The next expression compares each value in the color range C2 to C10 with the color value in G5. Multiply these three arrays. The multiplication operation converts true false into 1 0 and returns an array where ones correspond to rows that match all the criteria. This is passed to the match function as the lookup array with a lookup value of 1. The match function returns the relative position of the row for which all the criteria are true, row 9 in our case. If there are several 1s in the array, the position of the first one is returned. The number returned by match is passed as row number argument to the index function. The index function returns $45 which is the value in the ninth position in the D2 to D10 array. You can also use another index function if you want to avoid using the array formula. The index function can handle arrays natively. Use this formula. In the second index, pass the result of multiplied arrays as array argument and pass 0 as row number argument for the formula to return the entire column array rather than a single value. Since it's a one column array, pass 1 for column number. This array is passed to the match function. Match finds the row number for which all the criteria are true and passes that number to the row number argument of the first index. The index function returns $45 which is the ninth value in the D2 to D10 array. To download the practice excel file, please click on the link in the description. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.